What if a person have zero concentration in the prayer? There is a difference between whether the prayer is valid or whether it's accepted. Valid because I made a perfect wudu, I faced the qibla, I made takbir, I fulfilled all the requirements. Maqbool or not maqbool, accepted or not accepted, this is in Allah's hands. And also a person who's offering the act of worship plays the most important role in that. So when a person is not attentive whatsoever, the hadith says his prayer will not be accepted. If a person has 90% khushu'a, so 90% of khushu'a will guarantee 90% qabul. 80%, 70%, 60%, if 10% only, then 10% will be accepted and the rest he was just doing the physical exercise. This is what the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said in the hadith. The Almighty Allah says in Surah Al-Mu'minun, successful indeed are the believers, those who tranquil in their prayers. الَّذِينَ هُمْ فِي صَلَاتِهِمْ خَاشِعُونَ You're talking to Allah. I understand that when somebody says, I lose concentration a lot in the prayer. That makes sense because we're humans. We think about things and we get back to the prayer. But when somebody 100% Losing concentration, so which part exactly in the prayer do you consider a prayer? From saying Allahu Akbar to saying Assalamu Alaikum no khushu'ah? When you say because of lacking of sleep, you know that the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said لِيُصَلِّ أَحَدُكُمْ نَشَاطَهُ فَإِذَا فَتَرَ فَلْيَرْخُدْ يعني Whenever you are so tired, fatigued and sleepy, lie down and when you wake up pray. This is for the night prayer. For the third prayer, if there is enough time where you can take a nap and get up to pray, do that. The Prophet ﷺ said, لا صلاة لحاذق ولا لحاقن ولا لحاقب. I've discussed this 14 years ago in the program of the Prophet's prayer, where a person who's praying while resisting the urge of answering the call of nature, he wants to do number one, number two, to break wind. And he's saying, let me just wrap it up, finish the prayer so I don't have to make another wudu. Such prayer is invalid. Because the person is praying while under pressure of answering the call of nature. In case of food, you're hungry and the food smells yummy. The Prophet Wasallam said, when dinner is served and the prayer is due, begin by eating the food. So that when you say, Allahu Akbar, you know what you're saying. May Allah guide us to the best.